I'm going to do an exercise for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. This exercise I call Siamese Sprints because I'm going to force myself to make quick decisions under two minutes. If you're new to Mahjong or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. I have my trusty smartphone with a stopwatch app. I'm going to use this to track my time. I'll do five laps. Laps one, three, and five will be the sprints. Laps two and four will be set up and then we'll take an average. My goal is to make decisions in under two minutes. Because when you play online at SiamiseMahjong.com, if you don't make the decision quick enough, the game will toss a tile for you. And it might be a tile you need. I rolled an 11. If I roll an odd number, I'm player one. If I roll an even number, I'm player two. So for the first sprint, we're going to be the dealer. We get an extra tile. Not that it matters because we just discard to start the game. Player one, 28 tiles. Three flowers. The jokers are nice, I must say. Ooh. Okay, pair of sixes there. Some winds and dragons. Two, one, pung of ones. Look at that. Okay, let's see. Seven, eight, six, seven, eight, two, four, six, eight. Here's two. White dragon, year hand with news. Year with news, sixes, six, seven, six, seven, flowers. Look at the ones, ones. Oh, geez, I'm gonna go over my time. This is, this is not good. One, two, three, Kongs. Joker bait, Joker bait right here. One, two, three, Kongs, lap. Whoa, yikes, this is really light. And we only need one flower or a pair of flowers really. Let's keep spring and summer, not that it matters. One, two, three, mixed suit Kongs. News with the year, Joker bait. All these would be discards. I think you know what I would do is just hold, hold this because there is a hand for consecutive run using flowers and two numbers in a sequence, six, seven, six, seven, but we have a gap. I think I would do that. Maybe even hold one, two, one, two, dragon. Maybe hold that and that as well for an option for consecutive run. Discard those. Keep the two and the dragon for options. Keep these for options. See if the year comes in. I think that's what I would do right there. I think I went over a little bit because I did change my mind on these and that. If you would do something different here, write sprint one and what you would do with these tiles. We kind of have one, two, three hands going and then an option for consecutive. I want to use that for sure though. We have two multiples there and only one here, but there's no gaps except for our singles. I 
I rolled an odd, we're east again. Player one. Wow, look at those dots. One, three, five, six, seven. I think I would try to play the pair hand. One, two, three, we need a four dot. We have a Kong in there though. There's a Kong. Okay, let's see. Five, six, five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight. And then up here, two, one, two, three, two, three, four consecutive run. I wouldn't pick a hand though. Six discards. This is what I would do. Consecutive run, one, two, three, four, probably. Four numbers since we're in mixed suits. There's one hand that uses mixed suits with a four number range. One, two, three, like numbers, which we really don't have. I was thinking more like two, three, four crack mixed suit Kong hand. Third one down. I don't think we could use the dragons. But here, five, six, seven, eight. Pung Kong, Pung Kong. Obviously we have a gap, but we could use jokers. And I know we can't keep all these tiles. I would leverage the two, three, probably either four or one. These probably would have to go away, but I would hold them and gather, gather until a hand reveals itself. Probably though, if I had to pick a hand, one, two, three, or two, three, four, I would try to use these right here. Discard all those first. Probably I would do wins first, then the dragons. If you're not going to use wins and dragons, discard them early. If you would do something differently with these tiles, write it in the comment section below. I was thinking we could keep the seven for an option. Five, six, seven, flower. And then do mix suit consecutive run. You can keep one tile. Who knows? I rolled six, so we're going to be player two. Player two. Okay, here we go. Jokers, pair, some wins and dragons. Six, seven, ones, fours, seven, eight, seven, eight, six, seven, seven, eight. Let's see. Sevens, four, five, six, five, four, five, six, seven, seven. Maybe. We have a gap. Four, five, six, seven, seven. Like numbers with sevens. Sixes. 
we have no twos. Six, seven, six, seven, eight, nine, seven, eight, seven, eight, three, five, one, three, five. Oh my gosh, this one's hard. This one is very difficult. Seven, eight, six, seven, six, seven, eight consecutive run. White dragon, little odds with opposite dragons. One, three, three, five. One, three, three, five dragon. Look at that. One, three, five little odds. I would just hold it all. Okay, that's what I would do. Oh my gosh, I went way over on that one. But I think we got a plan here. It's going to take some work though. Discards, Joker bait. Little odds. One, three, five. I would not pick a hand. If I had to pick a hand, maybe one, one, three, three, five, or no, one, three, three, five, dragon, or one, three, five, Kongs with the flower. Then down here, six, seven, maybe six, seven, six, seven, no, six, seven, eight, nine, six, seven, eight, nine. I don't like dedicating jokers that early though, but I would hold all the six, seven, five, six, seven, eight, or six, seven, eight, nine, probably six, seven, eight, nine, because we're using fives up here. Use that as joker bait. I think that's how I would play this one. This one was really difficult. We do have one, three, five though, a pretty good representation here. One, three, three, five. One, three, three, five dragon. It's doable. Let's see how things went with time though. Oh, that was really challenging, that last one. I know I went over really bad. Sprint one, two minutes and six seconds. I went over. Sprint two, one minute 45. So I have 15 seconds to spare. The last one though, two minutes and 38 seconds. Yeah, I went over. I need to practice. This is why you practice. Let's see here. I went over by 18 seconds, 25 seconds over as in, let's see. But if you take that as an average, that's like eight seconds over that's not bad my goal is two minutes under two minutes if i can because when you play at mahjong time if you don't make a decision quick enough the game will toss your tile that's happened to me enough to where i want to make quick decisions and i know that if i make the wrong decision i can recover during picking and discarding so making a quick decision is a good thing that's why I like to do these sprints. If you have a set at home, give it a try and let me know if it helps you. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click that little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next Siamese sprints for American Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules, may all your picks be keepers.